Jake Ludington here at Discover 2015 in London, and I'm here with Chris Liberty. And you guys have a partnership with Virgin that you are helping the Formula E cars get better. This is really exciting. We're working with DS Virgin Racing. Uh, DS is the, um, the uh, premium brand of the Citroen um, automotive group. And uh, DS and Virgin have been racing in the uh, Formula E, which is a, a Formula One type circuit uh, for electric race cars. Uh, the cars look just like Formula One cars, uh, but they run completely on battery power. No, no engines, uh, direct drive uh, around the track. It's actually pretty cool because um, in order to have a, a pit stop, um, actually there's no refueling or recharging. There's no changing batteries, it's changing cars. The driver gets out of one car and gets into the second car. Every driver gets two cars for the race. So it's a really cool concept, uh, really quiet and lacking in any kind of emissions. So what Virgin is doing uh, with DS is they're working to really uh, increase the efficiency, accelerate the efficiency of electric cars, right? So it's all about um, energy density, the battery. It's all about the, um, the, the right weight ratio and learning about how best to manage the power as you're driving through a circuit. And so what HP does, HPE does for um, DS Virgin, is we analyze their data. And it's, uh, it's very cool because they're generating structured data, you know, uh, in-race performance data of the, the drivers, uh, the car, the battery, all that kind of stuff. It's very structured. We're using Vertica to analyze those data. Um, but we're also analyzing unstructured data, like video of the race and the trajectory of the car, the, its line as it goes through a turn. Um, you know, uh, even fan reactions to the race. And that unstructured data is also getting fed in through autonomy. So I have to ask, so this is all um, under the, the Living Progress uh, yeah. banner at HP. How does that fit in with the idea of corporate citizenship? Well, it, it's, a, it's a really cool directive uh, in the sense that, you know, Living Progress is partly about accelerating the efficiency of our, uh, our data centers, our servers, our way of providing um, you know, big data analytics to our customers. And so we're doing that for Virgin. Uh, we're, we're not only collecting these data and analyzing them, but we're doing it on moonshot servers that are 60% more energy efficient, 80% more space efficient, so Virgin can take them with them from race to race. Um, so we're proving our own technology in the process of helping them. But it's also central to what we need to do. I mean, we have to find ways to sustainably meet the data needs of the future. So, you know, in addition to helping Virgin with a, a very laudable objective, which is improving the efficiency of electric cars, we're also learning about how do we provide data uh, to our bigger customers uh, in a way that's even more efficient in the future. Um, you know, it, it's just amazing to me that, you know, right now, the public cloud is using more energy than the countries of Germany and Japan combined. So that's a, that's a lot of energy. That's a lot of energy. So you know, it, it's clear that you know, Meg Whitman has, has called that out and said, you know, business as usual is not sustainable. We can't keep meeting the data needs of the future using conventional methods. So by testing things with Vir DS Virgin, and by you know continuing to innovate in our own right in our technology, you know, we're finding ways to sustainably meet the data needs of the future. So you're kind of getting to combine some some fun and some actual real business learnings it all in fun. one package. And I'll tell you, it's it's uh, it's it's been a great attraction having the car here. Um, you know, I was really excited to have it here on a number of levels. Obviously, the partnership is awesome, but it just draws people here, and we get them into a conversation about sustainability uh, and about the great things HP HPE does in that area that people don't know about. So, very cool. Thanks, Chris. Great. Thanks, Jake.